Okay, we have a carry kettle and it's supposed to be a really good survival tool. And um, just going to do a demo on how it works. And uh, maybe some other people out there like this thing because we really like the idea of it. First of all, we've got to chop a bit of wood and that. Uh, so we can stick it into the. Watch yourself, out of the way. Bye. Major, come. I don't like doing it on there really, either. Could have been a bit deeper. But it's still a good idea. I still like the idea. Okay. Now, uh, in the old ones, we uh, saw and see this all year, always best to have it facing the wind, which is over there. So if I stick that by there, and the wind goes in here, and then you've got a hollow in this. This, should I show it to you? Yeah. Oh, yes, a rocket fuel. Yeah. In the old version, this uh, plug. It was orange, yeah? Yeah, it was orange, and um, you had to take it out when you had the fire on. But this one, they've uh, bettered the idea, they've made a breathing hole in it. And so, a whistle, huh? And a whistle, so when it starts boiling, you can uh, know that it's uh, the water's boiling. Yeah, so, without it. And you see uh, what I like about it, you can feed it from this end. But then you block the hole, so you feed it from the top. Yeah, and yeah. you can also feed it from the top. Like that, which is cool. You can cook on top of there. So I'll just go and get the... Oh, we want to make a time. What is your time now? How oh. long does it take? It's a full kettle. The time? Oops. It's 14.51. Okay. So I'll just get the, the other thing. Mess tin full with water. So if you were going to cook as well as have a cup of tea, you can cook on top of it and use the, um, the spacer. I don't know what they call it. And uh, you stick them over the top like this. Stick them together like this first. And you stick that on top of there. And you stick our mess tin on top of there. So we've got two things cooking here, we've got the water cooking up for tea and we got maybe our food on top. I just put water on there. Now time is 14.53.22. How many minutes have passed? I think I hear the water. It's 58, 6 minutes. Hmm, so not so fast as they said, they said you can Boil the whole kettle with five minutes. In five minutes? No, do it depends. If you're up high. No, it's coming. Yeah, if you're up high, it falls Look. quicker. Let me see your watch. Boiling after six minutes. Okay. Well, it's a really small amount of wood and we've got it boiling up. It took six minutes, but what I will say is, they did say it took five minutes, this took six minutes, but we are lower down to sea level. Yeah. And the higher up you are, the less air pressure there is, so it's going gonna, it's gonna to boil quicker if you're higher up. Yeah, so and it also it. depends, do you, yeah. we had ice cold water, yeah. that takes a little bit longer. Yeah. It's only, um, this lightweight is made of aluminium, 
Yeah, the top, the yeah, bottom. So you need to be uh, careful along, you know, not to be forgetful with it because aluminium, you know, when it's when there's no water in it, it's gonna melt it in no time. And especially the, the yeah. intensity of the heat that you get in here, because that blows up quite well, like a little furnace in there, isn't it? They call it rocket. Yeah. Rocket. Zone. So you are going to damage it if you um, if you forget to put water in there or to keep the water in there. The methane water is not boiling and it's probably only about half a litre of water in there. And how much is in the Cadley kettle? 1.6 litres. And that only took six minutes? Yeah. yeah. So there's definitely a massive discrepancy from the heat that goes up there to the heat that goes into there. We are doing this indoors, I mean, I think we've been a bit unfair really by saying about the wood that's burning inside of the kettle that when you pick it up it's going to drop and burn the table because you won't have it on a table outdoors, will you? No, indoors, that's so right. All of this stuff is really uh, picking next to it. That's going to be hot, so I don't have to, to um, mm -mm. clean it off. And now, the matter of Okay, my wife just told me I picked it up wrong. I shouldn't pick it up like this because you've got flames coming up into your hand and stairs do it, it does burn a bit. But I'm a man. You pick it up like this, which don't feel very good actually because this is only um, not very strong. So I think you could probably, if you knock it, yeah, that'll bend that will. Oh, got it. Okay, these are two half litre cups and this holds 1.6 litres in it. I think we boiled a lot of the water away trying to get the, the nest in to boil up. There's about a litre of water left. Yeah, yeah it. but it was boiling for about 20 yeah, minutes. So. Yeah, 21 minutes, isn't it? That's so. almost empty now. What I do you? Th oh yeah, there's a bit left. What do you think about it? What do I think about that? Well, it's really light. That's what I like about it. Although it's big, a bit bulky. Yeah, we bought a bigger size, eh? This yeah. is the biggest. Yeah. You can get Base a, camp, this two is. Two sizes smaller than this. Yeah. Uh, this is large, and it's medium and small. Yeah. But because there's two of us, yeah. we have the biggest one. Yeah. And we like big cups. Yeah, of that's right. And uh, I, I think, this, yes, for my kit bag, and camp out bushcraft, like, I think that's... Um, it's a bonus, that one. It's worth taking, yeah, eh? I think it's worth taking. It's worth the space in your bag. It's nice and light. And um, we've got some other bits to show, yeah? Yes. Bit more. Here's the, uh, the other part of it. Goes on top of there, like that. Let's put it in the right direction for the wind. Okay, here's the uh, other part for cooking. Your frying pan or boiling some whatever. And use a little device I like. It's to blow in fire up so you don't get the smoke in your face like we often do. <laughs> okay, so the fire's gone down. Let's see if you can blow them up a bit here.
boat to one again. Yeah, and there's only a few pounds there, eh, that thing. Yeah, really and well worth it, yeah. What's yeah. on? And now we begin. See how long okay. it takes. Let's drink our tea, shall we? It's just starting. It's just starting to boil now the water, as you can see, and it's nearly 12 minutes. Wow. But it, what a difference. That's only a pint. Yeah, pint of water. And 1.6 litres, yeah. that is uh, one, two, three, over three pints, and that yeah. was only six minutes. Yeah, but that's certainly the most effective way to boil water. Yeah. But if you're cooking food, now uh, the wife mm -hmm. is going to do a fry up. Yeah, not too much, otherwise we don't get the airflow. No, it will once it starts. Okay, then you can go straight on now. Okay, let's see. Can you put the timer on? See how much that yeah. takes. Okay. Food just gone now. Time now to begin. It's taken 18 minutes to cook up fry some up, yeah. little fry up. But we were a bit uh, wrong with the hole in it, Phil. Can you explain that? Yeah, well, well we have, I have to... This is a feed hole. Well, there's two feed holes. Yeah. I had them both the same side. But it needed to be, Opposite. the top feed all needed to be the other side. Yeah. And then that spread the heat yeah. right across the whole area. Of yeah. the, and the then area. it went really fast suddenly. Yeah. So it would have been yeah. ready way before this. Okay, what do you think about it? But, well, again, I like this frying pan. I, I don't know. It comes it, from something else. So that is not yeah, from that. Yeah, comes from something else, a frying pan. But yeah. this. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I think that's a bonus for your kit bag, and uh, because it's lightweight again, um, you can cook on it. See if you have to mess around with the, you know, when you put the frying pan on top of the wood or you yeah. hang it over the top. You don't need none of that with this. You just carry your knife, or you don't need to carry any um, gas tins with it. That's right, and you hardly use any wood. Yes, it's fantastic. What do you think of the new uh, tea uh, cups? The cups we have. These? Yeah. Yeah, they're good. What I like about them is um, you can put the hot water and uh, you don't burn your mouth on there. You know, so it's, it's not um, all yeah. metal, that. And it's double walled, isn't it? Yeah, double walled, so you don't burn your lips when you put it and up it your mouth. And it stayed really long warm, eh? Yeah. And we have tops as well with them yeah. if you want, the isn't tops it? tops of it. That's the uh, brand name there. And no. got, I didn't like this, actually, because uh, <coughs> they, they got a rubber band around there. And um, I wouldn't see where it went. I put it up there to start with. But um, when you put it in, I had to fiddle around with it a bit. And it's not really, oh, it's a, it's a nice fit. Yeah. It keeps it warm. But um, it's you, a bit. And you loose. can drink it as well, isn't it? Or? Yeah, you can drink it from by doing this. So, ah. See, you turn that. Cool. Yeah, that's cool. Especially so, when we're in Sweden and it's cold. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much. It's all right. <laughs> thank you for watching. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Press the like button. Uh, sign up, subscribe. Yeah. And all the rest of that kind of shit. <laughs>